Hello guys, welcome to our new update of Core Framework. This is version 1.9.0 and this update sees a very highly requested feature which is custom style sheets. So as you can see here we have a new tab and now we have our custom style sheets. So I can type anything here, any new class for example, and you can see here over on the right we have unknown word new class. Uh, that's just showing because we don't have it closed or anything like that yet. So it does come with real time error checking. So I'm going to add here color and another nice thing about this is we also have our variables being pulled in from core framework. So I can add my primary color or my secondary colors, uh, anything like that. If I type secondary font size as well, I will do text. Uh, L just so it's easy to see. When I save changes, what you'll notice in preview CSS, any custom styles will get added to the very bottom, as you can see right here. I can also add different style sheets if I want. So if I want to consolidate, for example, animations, I can put them all in here. And let's add an animation now, for example. So animations, add your custom CSS here for animations. And I'm just going to copy uh, an example here that I made. Now, let's say we have some formatting issues. Maybe we are copying minified CSS. You can just simply click on this format CSS button and it will be formatted automatically. So save preview and you'll notice that now we have this new comment and this is for my animations. So let's open up a page here. Okay, so I'm going to add a text element. So uh, just a small mistake there. We forgot to add the var. So my bad there. Refresh. There we go. And now let's go ahead and add the div so we can see the animation take place. And that was called box. And as you can see, our animation is also being applied. So because this is quite literally a custom CSS, we can add anything that we like, ranging from animations, container queries, anything like that. So the possibilities are now quite endless with Core Framework. So we hope you like this update, guys. Uh, if you have any questions, please put it in the comments below. Thank you.